Hey everyone, in this video, I'm gonna show you how to hack the Mesa Quad Wave using Python. It all starts with the Quad Wave MIDI Bridge, an open source Python tool that you connect to the Quad Wave. It lets you intercept, modify, or completely redefine how the instrument behaves. The repos on GitHub, link in the description. With this new bridge, you can hack the Quad Wave's output and extend its capabilities. The bridge gives you raw access to the sensor data coming off the Quad Wave every fret press, every touchpad gesture, right into Python. You can write Python code to respond to quad wave events and send your own MIDI out. Or you can make these sensor events trigger anything that Python can, lights, visuals, whatever you can imagine. You can even bypass the quad wave's default behavior entirely and reinterpret the sensor data in Python to implement your own control schemes, making the instrument behave in completely different ways. Let me show you how to get this running. Git clone the repo and install the dependencies. If you're on Windows, install Loop MIDI and create a virtual port, named, say, Mesa Loopback. This is the name of the port your workstation or synth will listen to, not the QuadWave's MIDI port. Then run the bridge like this. Next, enable RAW mode on the QuadWave. Hold down the highest fret on all four strings until the LEDs flash rapidly. Now you're getting RAW input fret positions, touch panel coordinates, configuration changes, it's all streaming into Python. From here, you own the control layer. You can filter or completely override the Quad Wave's built-in MIDI output, replacing it with your own controls. This makes it behave completely different to the stock behavior. Here, I've got Vital running, listening on the loopback port. The bridge passes MIDI through by default, so you can just plug and play. But again, you're not locked into that. Hack the Python bridge to make the quad wave behave in new ways it has never done before. So that's it. Grab the code from GitHub, experiment, create a pull request, and reach out if you have any questions, comments, or suggestions. Thanks for watching.